Dance and figure skating are my two primary areas of interest. Having spent most of my life in an ice rink, I think that helps the skaters to know that you know what they're going through, at least on some level. Did you have Alex's lace bite? which comes from some irritation on the tendons in the front of the ankle. It's usually from the boot. But as long as it doesn't bother you that much, I don't think we have to limit what you have to do or okay. what you can do. Yeah. To have someone come in and be just completely anxious and nervous about a diagnosis or a potential diagnosis, and then for them to be able to leave and say, you know what, it's going to be okay. We're going to fix this. We're going to take care of it. Maybe it's not exactly what I want to happen right now, but it's going to be all right. For me, that's that's what it's about. Keep an eye on it. If it continues to worsen, anything changes, you let me know. Most of what we see in figure skating is overuse just because of the repetitive nature, but it's not just about taking care of what happens, it's trying to figure out why it happened. And part of injury prevention then is if you understand the why, then you can maybe do something to correct it. Many of these skaters are doing probably the majority of their training during a time in their life when their bodies are growing. And so it's a constant battle to keep up with that. Once they've grown, they lose flexibility. And then they also are going to then lose some strength because they've got a different structure to work with. So we have to constantly rebuild that. Working with the most elite of any activity helps you understand what the major demands are and what the biggest demand may be for an, an upcoming athlete. But I think the care and thoughtfulness that we put into it is going to be the same for any child or athlete that walks through our door because it's, it's about preparing them for whatever future they may have. The commitment and the dedication of my colleagues here at Sports Medicine. We all have our, our niche, so to speak, in terms of ability, interest, uh, passion, dedication. Uh, and if we don't know the answer, we sure know where to find it.